Hi, Gemini. Hi, Gemini. This is your reading for the end of <laughs> February. Um, okay, so you have the Strength card with the Ace of Pentacles and the Six of Swords. So it looks like um, you've been trying to like tame like your wildness, your sense of adventure, your you've been trying to calm it down a little and be more stable, but um, there's been this like new opportunity handed to you, so you really don't know what to do with it, so you're like trying to get away from people right now, get away from your mind, go on your own exploration, um, maybe take a couple people with you, um, also too, it might not even be you trying to get away from your, um, ad sense of adventure, or more like finding your sense of adventure, it might be you like trying to tame these wild ass thoughts in your mind or your ego or your whatever to put you in a position that's going to make you want to go while you're in a stable position not like oh up and go and like fuck shit up you know what i'm saying okay what other energies do we have Whenever you get to your destination, though, it's going to be victory for sure. So whatever your, um, whatever travel plans you have right now, or whatever, like, um, you've been feeling like going, whatever trips you want to take, like, now's the great time to go. Um, because whatever you do with those, it's going to, it's going to prosper. But you're definitely getting away from, like, some different energy. I feel like everyone's in this, like, huge time of transition. But you're still feeling like a little bit like, mm, not really like financially hurting, I don't think, but more along the lines of like trading friends. It's like you're leaving a lot of people behind and you're moving on to this new life. And I think a lot of people are, but it has you feeling like a sense of like um, insecurity, I guess, because you're used to having all these friends and you don't want to like not be friends with anybody. But at the same time, it's like time for you to move on and like get away from this, like, place. Yeah. You can, like, move on to your, like, next thing. Okay, so... Ooh. So, the Ace of Wands was up with the world. So, with these two together, like, you're getting a... This is, like, a time of completion and a time of um, new beginnings, endings and new beginnings. So, what things make you feel complete? What things make you feel whole? What things make you um, beat the drum, like, to your own tune or whatever? Like, what things make you happy just for you and not for anybody else? And that's what's really important right now is, like, she's like, not worried about any of these other animals in this corner, in the four corners. She's only worrying about herself. And she doesn't give a fuck that she's naked. She don't give a fuck about none of this shit. She don't give a fuck that her little thing's flying off. She does not give a shit. She's just, like, marching to the beat of her own drum. She's, like, being fully in herself. So take the time to sit down and write down all the ways that you feel whole because those energies seem to, like, run away from us. Uh, they don't last very long. So while you're in that energy, you want to embody it fully. You want to be thankful and give an attitude of gratitude so that way you can manifest easier. But there is going to be like this, something's going to be like given with this, like a new idea, um, a new opportunity. Ooh. <clears throat> so you have like the Seven of Wands with this Four of Cups. So and the six of okay, so you have justice and the six of um, pentacles. So right now it's like trying to figure out 
for like a balance within things and there's like some sort of imbalance whether it's your finances or whether it's with like your friends or whether it's with something something in your life is like thrown off so you need to do like an evaluation and figure out what thing has you like psh, like teeter-tottering between the two you also have like the um the seven seven of wands and uh the four of cups which basically is saying like spirit has your back you don't have to fight and spirit is going to bring you this cup anyway so it's like you don't have to sit and pout because <clears throat> with this adventure you will have these new energies and even though you've never been here before you don't have a lot of money and you haven't used your sword or your worth when you start to use it for good like your work your words or like your sword or like whatever and you start to um, put this money back into yourself it's going to triple your finances or whatever it's going to like bring you hope and promise and abundance and attract new friends to spark this like creative creativity in the form of something that's going to manifest into these ten of pentacles so let me also to clarify and just to see like further but in a sense so getting in touch with your inner child getting in touch with your who you are your truest and purest sense who um you want to be and who you like think when you first got out of high school wanted to be like did you whatever you wanted to do during that age like now is the time to like sit and think and meditate on that and like go back to that and try to accomplish some of those goals and they don't necessarily have to like go get a fucking degree or something it could just be like go take some of those classes that you wanted to take just to take them just for the sense of like learning or like go do art or like go do some weird sports or like just take something some weird class just for fun even if it's online but i just think it's a, like a really important time for people there's a lot of creativity in the air and a lot of change like afoot so but yeah thanks for watching Jim and I don't forget to subscribe um like share comment whatever see you guys in March bye